What if I told you that for just $10,579, you could own a high-tech, fully equipped tiny home, five times cheaper than a used Tesla Model 3, and still sleep under a 55-inch TV while looking up at the stars through a glass roof above your shower? With housing prices going through the roof, for many seniors, veterans, students, and low-income families, the idea of owning a home feels like chasing a dream that's drifting farther away every day. But what if you could say goodbye to huge rent payments or lifetime mortgages and instead live in a compact, solar-powered, hurricane-proof casita that you could tow behind your own vehicle? Sounds unreal. That's the promise of the Tesla Tiny House, a living concept that reduces your expenses, clears your debt, and brings you a smart, eco-friendly lifestyle, all within 400 square feet of space. Hey, quick favor before we dive deeper. Our family here at Amp Drive is growing, but guess what? We're still small. Like, just 30 subscribers small. Be one of the first pioneers to hit that subscribe button and ride with us from the ground up. Trust us, being early is cool, and you'll help shape the future of the channel. Let's take this journey together. Click it now, before we become too mainstream winking face. Now, if Elon Musk can live comfortably in a foldable factory-made casita installed in just one afternoon, why can't you? Let's take a closer look and break down how Tesla's tiny house might be the solution to your biggest housing worries, and maybe even your biggest hopes. First, let's address the most asked question, is it really just $10,579? That price has gone viral, and for good reason. Yes, the base model includes the frame, shell, and basic structure. But there are more things you need to think about as a future owner. The first cost is land. Even a small patch of land good enough for a 400-square-foot home could cost several thousand dollars in rural places and tens of thousands near towns and cities. Then there's the matter of utility connections. While the Tesla tiny house is designed for easy hookup, just plug in the electricity and attach a garden hose, Local rules might require digging trenches, adding meters, and passing inspections. These costs can add a few hundred or even thousands more. On top of that, building permits, zoning approvals, and special permissions for RV-style structures are another hurdle. Depending on where you live, permits alone could cost between $1,500 to $3,000. And we're not done yet. There are development impact fees, city charges, and yearly property taxes to keep in mind. While the base delivery fee of $499 sounds low, it doesn't include preparing the land, like leveling it, adding gravel pads, or clearing space, which might cost another $1,000 to $2,500 if you hire someone to do it. In places that get hit by hurricanes or earthquakes, you might need extra support like raised platforms or special tie-downs, which also adds to the cost. If you want a nice interior beyond just the shell, extras like flooring, cabinets, appliances, and plumbing will increase the cost significantly. Pretty soon, the price could go up to around $19,999 for the mid-level version that Tesla has quietly shown in sneak peeks. Want even more features, like air filtering from SpaceX or water recycling systems? Those are optional but hard to say no to if you're aiming for full independence. But wait, is it even available yet? When can we buy it? That's another big question. Even though Elon Musk said, I live in a tiny house and it's amazing, Tesla hasn't officially launched this product yet. There's no pre-order page, no store link, nothing concrete. Tesla is still focused on their electric vehicles, Optimus Robot Project, and the Starship Rocket. The tiny house project seems to be on hold, for now. Experts think Tesla needs to lower the cost of producing solar roof tiles, power walls, and other energy parts before this housing dream becomes a reality. They estimate it could take another 18 to 24 months for production to really begin, maybe even longer. And before building can start on a large scale, Tesla has to meet many legal standards like the National Fire Protection Association's rules for mobile homes. Since the U.S. has over 3,000 counties with their own building codes, that's a huge legal puzzle. Still, there are whispers that Tesla is testing these homes in secret, 
possibly working with Boxable, the makers of the foldable casita design Elon Musk lives in. They're trying out real-world conditions from hurricane-hit Florida to snowy Colorado. Only after these tests succeed will Tesla consider a full launch. But with Musk's habit of setting ambitious timelines and missing them, the earliest we might see a real launch is probably late 2026 or maybe early 2027. So until Tesla makes an official announcement, your best bet is to keep an eye out, maybe sign up with partners like Boxable, and hope the dream becomes real once the gigafactories are running at full speed. Now let's talk about toughness, can the Tesla tiny house handle tough weather like hurricanes? Is it well insulated? Does it come already furnished? From what we know based on Musk's $40,000 boxable casita, this structure is no joke. It's built with tough multi-layered panels, steel frames taken from Cybertruck designs, and high-density foam for insulation based on materials from the Dragon spacecraft. These parts are pressed together with over 250,000 pounds of force to create a durable outer layer. The result? It can survive winds over 130 miles per hour, take on hail, and handle snow like a champ. Inside, electrical wiring and plumbing are pre-installed, making the setup easier and quicker. The walls have insulation with R values over 30, and ceilings go over R50, making it comfortable even during extreme cold or hot days. Standard models also include ventilation and the option to add air filtering tech from SpaceX, keeping the air inside clean and fresh. Large windows bring in light, and if you choose the see-through dome for the shower ceiling, you can gaze at the stars while taking a hot bath, pretty cool, right? There are three main options for buyers. The most basic model, at $10,579, comes as a shell with no furniture. The mid-level version, around $19,999, includes kitchen units, sofa beds, and bathroom fittings. The premium version, over $30,000, brings everything from a solar roof to a Tesla Powerwall, Starlink Internet, and smart home tech. What's more exciting is the ability to expand. Want another bedroom or office? You can attach a second unit. Want two floors? You can stack them. Modules connect using pre-made locking points and support structures. Solar energy can be shared between units using a combined energy system. A central screen or smartphone app allows you to control lighting, temperature, air recycling, and security from one place. Buyers can also upgrade the look and feel of their homes. You can choose finishes like wood, tiles, or even 3D printed textures. You can also wrap the exterior in colors that match your taste. Third-party add-ons like folding patios or rooftop decks make the space more personal and fun. Now you might wonder, is it really worth spending over $10,000 on one of Elon Musk's tiny houses? What do you gain, and what do you give up? Imagine walking into a house that looks small from the outside, just 400 square feet. You'd expect it to be super tight inside. But surprisingly, it feels as roomy and comfortable as a regular 800 square foot studio apartment in the city. And when you compare it to other tiny homes on the market, it really stands out. For example, EcoCraft Homes offers a 500 square foot model for $35,000. But it lacks the advanced technology and smart layout of Musk's version. Let's take a look at what makes his model special. In the living room, instead of a basic sofa and table, you get a smart workspace setup with power stations and fast internet. This space can serve as a home office just as functional as a workstation at Tesla's headquarters. Next is the sleeping area. Unlike other tiny homes where you sleep behind a curtain, Musk's design uses a half wall with shelves to separate the space. Storage is hidden under the bed and inside the wall. It's clever, clean, and saves space. And get this, there are three bedrooms in this tiny home. Yes, three. Musk took the attached garage space and turned it into an extra room. Using wall beds that fold down at night and hide away during the day, he created private sleeping areas without wasting any room. In the kitchen, Musk's home includes a sink, oven, fridge, dishwasher, and plenty of storage. 
the appliances fit right into the walls with sleek design. Compared to Greenhaven's $38,000 home that charges extra for simple appliances, Tesla's model feels like a bargain. The dining area is just as smart. A table folds out from the wall like a Murphy bed and comes with stools that hide away. It's strong, easy to use, and completely silent thanks to advanced hinges. Even the bathroom is high-end. You get a real toilet, sink with drawers, a big shower with a rainfall head, and glass doors. The walls are made of water-resistant panels that look like marble. This beats the usual plastic or vinyl used in other cheap builds. Lighting and air quality. Also upgraded. Instead of small lights and loud fans, Tesla's home includes quiet automatic exhaust fans and LED lights that change color to match the time of day, just like the lighting systems NASA uses for astronauts. Let's compare that to a $7,000 budget tiny house. A company like Frugal Dwellings offers a basic 350-square-foot model for $6,800. It has a fold-out sofa, a mini-fridge, a basic sink with foot pedals, and open shelving. It's not fancy, but it works. The bathroom includes a compost toilet and a shower with a vinyl curtain. Storage is mostly DIY, shelves from old pallets or boxes under the bed. The lighting is basic too, simple puck lights with no mood settings. Air flows through two open windows and a small fan. It's minimal, but for someone with a tight budget, it still offers freedom from rent and monthly bills. But here's the big question, does investing in Tesla's smart ecosystem, with solar panels, power walls, and energy-saving systems, give you true freedom? Or is it just a fancy way to sell more Tesla tech? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Are you ready for this revolution in living? Would you live in a Tesla tiny house? Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this deep dive and want more exciting updates on Tesla EVs, Optimus robots, and beyond, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to Amp Drive. We're just getting started, and trust us, you don't want to miss what's next. Stay charged and we'll see you in the next one.